The sofa problem is kind of weird. Given an L-shaped corridor with a width of one that bends 90 degrees, you're supposed to figure out what the largest sofa is that can be moved past it. This was a question mathematician Leo Moser posed in 1966, and one that we still don't have an answer for. Let's start by picking a sofa, like a unit square that can translate past a bend. A unit square only has an area of one, so a semicircle, with area pi over two, does much better than our square sofa. The first solution came in 1968, from mathematician John Hammersley, combining two quarter circles and a rectangle, and removing a semicircle, giving an area of 2.2074. Joseph Gerber improved on this in 1992 by adding 18 curves, bringing the number up to 2.2195. There's also another variant, called the ambidextrous sofa problem, where sofa needs to go around two bends, left and right. The best solution we have here is by Dan Romick, which has an area of about 1.645. To be honest, it doesn't look that comfortable. There's still yet to come for both of these problems though, so do keep in mind that the solutions shown here are just the best we've found so far.